Hey there and welcome back to the channel. This is Mel's Gaming here with another Valheim video. Now, in this video I am going to show off the first boss that you will encounter in Valheim, which is, if I, I'll try and pronounce it correctly, Eichthyr? Which is basically a massive elk stag with just these huge antlers with chains wrapped around them and he can cast like lightning. It's some kind of big deer and it's really cool. What he's actually technically meant to be, I'm not sure, but what he is is absolutely awesome. So you will get told to register his location when you first spawn in and then you will need to go and craft stuff to fight him. So I did this fight in a bit of an odd way. I chose to do it with spear and shield. However, the best method for taking down this boss, which I will show at the end, which I found out mainly actually I found out from my friends when we were playing in more of a group, which we now have a server where we all play, is to use bow and arrows. Fire arrows work particularly well, but bow and arrows is the way to go, not spear and shield like I chose to do. However, it can be done, it can be done singly, he's not too hard once you know what you're doing, and he's just a really, really cool boss. So, uh, you'll see me fighting him now as a single player, and then in the group at the very end, and you'll see, as I say, the end clip is what you should do, bow and arrows and keep away from him, not what I chose to do when I was doing it singly, which is charge at him with a spear and a shield. But you can do it with a spear and a shield, because I did it, so I mean that works too. But all you're going to need, once you've got his location, is you're going to need two deer trophies. Now, to actually acquire the deer trophies, the easiest way is to sneak up on a deer with your crouch button and sneak right up to it and hit it with your axe or spear or whatever you've got weapon-wise really, and it should one-hit it as long as you sneak right up to it. Now, like I said, you're going to need two of these trophies. They won't drop trophies every single time you kill one of these deer, so just be aware of that, that you may need to kill a few deer to get the trophies. And then basically you go back to where he's been registered as his location for his sacrificial stones on the map. You go there, you make the sacrifice of the two deer trophies, and then basically you defeat him. And then once you've got his head, you take it back to the like, main sacrificial stones and you hang the trophy head on the hook that is provided and then you can access his power. Now that is really cool, Ikthyr gives you like extra stamina power, it's really 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 useful when you're doing boss fights or you need just need to run or have your stamina like really extra good, it's so so useful. And like I said, this is the first boss you will encounter. You have to defeat him in order to progress. So getting him out of the way as quickly as possible is going to be really useful. You can actually make pickaxes from pieces of his antler, which then allows you to mine for metals so you can get better gear. And it sort of progresses you to the next step of the game. So really try and take this boss down as quickly as you can. If you're in a group, you'll be able to do it really, really easily. If you're doing it alone, like I said, bow and arrow is kind of meant to be the easier way to do it, but you can just do it with a spear and shield and that you can get the spear and the shield really quickly. So very easily done. Also, don't do what I did here and only eat one piece of food. Eat your three pieces of food. It's a bit of an unusual health regain system in this game. You need to eat a balanced diet. So you need to have basically the, the meal I tend to go with is meat and then I eat blueberries and either raspberries or carrots or mushrooms, anything that you can find really to get your hands on because you can't eat the same thing three times. You have to eat three different pieces. So if you can do that, then that's going to give you extra health and you're not going to be in quite as bad shape as I was here. So that's pretty much all you need to do in order to defeat the first boss. I hope this has been in some way useful if you're trying to defeat the first boss for yourself, either as I said, single player or as a group. And I really hope if you're playing the game that you're enjoying it as much as I am. If you are playing it and you're watching this, please let me know in the comments if you're enjoying it. I am really loving Valheim. I just love everything about it, the art style. It's so pretty, this game. Like, even this boss, he is really, really pretty to look at. Like, with those big antlers with the, like, the lightning and the chains. So yeah, let me know if you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think. I hope you've enjoyed this video and thank you very much for watching.